In this video, we learn about advanced features of Rivera Pro Wave Form Viewer. I have already initialized simulation here. So let's add signals to the waveform and run simulation. Now you can set a bookmark with more advanced properties. So let's add a bookmark here and with the comment. So here you can give a name to the bookmark test and it will save the bookmark will save the time location where you have set bookmark and it will save the object name where you have kept the bookmark on which object and it will save your zoom factor so when you go to that bookmark it will restore your zoom factor and then you can save a comment here so in case if you don't remember if you forget later on why you kept a bookmark there you can have a comment here and add it so the bookmark will be added at that location here now set another bookmark you can set multiple bookmarks so if you can set another bookmark at this location again uh, in this signal so that bookmark will be added there right here and then we can add one more bookmark at here and then you can jump between the bookmarks by using this previous bookmark button and the next bookmark button so let's say now you are zoomed out and when you go to the previous bookmark it will restore your zoom factor as you can see here and the same way if you go to the next previous bookmark here it will go it will uh, restore your zoom factor as well as it will give you a comment at that location that why you kept a bookmark so what's the, what you are looking for at that location now as Rivera Pro is event driven simulator it uses delta delay mechanism so each signal assignment requires one delta cycle to update its value everything happens in no time it's infinite time you can open that delta delay and you can see different signal assignment happening at different time so here these signal assignments are changing the signals are changing their values from uninitialized to 40 at 0 plus 1 uh, uh, delta cycle here and these values are being changed at 0 plus de uh, 2 delta here so that way you can open delta uh, cycle at any locations here you can open multiple data cycles so as you can see here values are changing so it's happening at of all all things are happening happening at 15th microsecond here but as you can see internally those signal assignments happens at different uh, time here this happens at delta plus one so 15 plus one this is 15 plus two so you can have multiple delta open in Rivera Pro waveform here and this is a really useful tool in de uh, debugging your risk conditions inside your design and then you can close all the delta together Rivera Pro Waveform Viewer offers a lot of uh, virtual objects which you can create. So let's say if you want to create a group for these all expected LED signals, you can select all of these signals here, uh, right click and then create a virtual group which will create a virtual group here and add all the signals into that so it will group all these expected signals and you can easily move around these uh, signals and groups inside in the Waveform Viewer. Now you can rename this uh, group as well. So you can say here uh, expected signals and then uh, uh, now another uh, virtual object Rivera Pro Waveform Viewer has to offer is uh, uh, virtual record. So you can create this all of you can select all of these actual LEDs right click on that and you can create a virtual record out of it so that will create a virtual record here and we can keep to uh, keep it with the virtual group as you can see the virtual record uh, aggregates all the values from the signals which we have added inside the record and virtual group keeps them grouped so it doesn't aggregate the value here so now here in this virtual record you can search values you can combine this different uh, signals into one and then you can search inside uh, any values you are looking for in that bus here and you can rename this virtual bus as well and you can keep this virtual bus inside the virtual group so that way you can have a hierarchy of uh, things here so the best way to use this is you can keep uh, groups of different hierarchy here and you can load different objects uh, related to that hierarchy inside uh, the groups another virtual object Rivera Pro Waveform Viewer has to offer is virtual array in this case if let's say if you want to see only these three bits here you want to observe the values of this three bit select those three bits right click on it 
and select create virtual array which will create a virtual array out of it now you can move that virtual array out of that bus and you can rename it let's rename it to slice 3 to 1 now here in this virtual array you will see the combined value of these three bits here so if you expand this you'll see the values as things started changing from here you'll see the uh, combined value in this virtual array now you can search in that virtual array using this find value button so if you want to search in these three particular bits of course you can expand this and see but it will be much more easier if you create a virtual array out of it and now you can search uh, inside it so select that virtual array right click on it and select find value here and then now if you want to search any value inside that let's say you want to search 2 and select find next and it will search the next value in that so this way you can search in the slices of bits thank you for watching this video